Meni je drago da već četvrta godina održavamo jednu vrlo značajnu i jaku konferenciju, a to se vidi prema odazivu međunarodnih stručnjaka, domaćih stručnjaka. Kontinuirano i predano radimo na održivom i otpornom putu hrvatskih gospodarstvenika u budućnosti, odnosno na podizanju njihove konkurentnosti. Croatia has a lot of potential when it comes to green and blue economy and uh, we are here to support Croatian businesses. Croatia is a country that is now entering the opportunity of the fourth industrial revolution by largely shifting the attention from services to what they could become digital ecosystems. Once digital ecosystems are created, you're going to be able to attract talent in the region. I'd be very happy to be here in, in Zagreb in this event. I, I just see that there's so much interest and buzz about the green economy, blue economy, which seems to be very close to, to the Croatian's heart. And I think that's, that's one area where I hope to see more action from Croatia in the future. What the uh, Chamber of Economy is doing in Croatia is quite remarkable. It's bringing together sustainability leaders and it's mixing in the critical role of sustainable finance and responsible investment. I haven't seen a gathering like this for a long time. Upravo smo završili dvije solarne elektrane kao prvi komercijalni projekt gdje će INA postati proizvođač i trgovac obnovljive izvore energije. Javnica na ovom skupu predstavila svoj novi projekt koji smo nazvali Jana u Janu. Jer smo iz nas, naše postojeće Jane, iz naše boce Jane, uključili dionike kao što su sakupljači, obrađivači, ponovo proizvođači predoblika koji proizvode onda predoblik za našu bocu. Nek se planira završiti cjelokupno energetsku i zelenu tranziciju poslovanja do 2030. godine. Mi smo hrvatski brand koji je stvorio najekološku obuću na svijetu. Naši tenisice su 97% izrađene od prirodnih materijala. Jaste banka u Hrvatsko radi u području zelene transformacije i ješći puno projekata sa našim klijentima, ali ja bih malo se fokusirao na to da smo počeli još prije pandemije sa jednim projektom koji se zove Škola pametnih financija. Znači, to je edukacija firma, zaposlenika firma, ali i građanstvo. Posebno bi istaknuo našu saradnju sa Humanom Novom, socijalnom zadrugom. Ljudi koji teže dobivaju prilike za poslove koji su na bilo koji način marginalizirani, da ih možemo uključiti u, u realni i održivi biznis. Upravo se očekuje da će taj element održivosti u budućnosti odvajati uspješne od manje uspješnih poduzetnika. One of our use cases, we worked with a team from IKEA and they prototyped within a few days a system that was a completely new system for their online catalog. Their catalog to ask a couple of simple questions without cookies, with complete anonymity, without following you, without you having to click those boxes and say, okay, what is it you're after? And then they mapped it, they mapped the knowledge related to this and gave exactly the right answers. They saved huge amounts of data carbon footprint. There are so many things that are being wasted around the world. The world is only 7% circular, so there's 90% of all the value materials that get destroyed every year. And circular economy is about how we can be more resource sufficient and efficient and keep the value of the resources we have as long as possible. The first thing that we also want to make sure of is that the technology itself is sustainable. So if we're looking at things like the carbon footprint and the water footprint of data centers, particularly as generative AI starts to become more and more popular, we really need transparency around the numbers. Innovation is not just about making money, it's about creating the future. I'm on the board of, of large companies. The issue they have always is about what is our next innovation. How you want to use it, how you want to structure it, and how you want to bill those companies, which right now are just taking data, taking resources, and could be giving back. There is no such thing as waste. Waste is just valuable resources in the wrong place.
We have uh, several techniques and uh, tools that help us create pathways, which is basically strategies that accomplish uh, that vision through the use of business model innovation, sustainability, uh, innovation for products and services that companies can uh, imagine that will definitely disrupt the current thinking of the management team. Mislim da je jako bitno da razmišljamo šire, da pređemo na neki način iz tog ego sustava u ekosustav, jer niko ne može sam riješiti sve sve te izazove koje su ispred nas.